everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum. In the last video, we tracked down Harley Quinn and we destroyed her! The Batman with all his mighty might, uh, defeated Harley Quinn, I suppose. It's, I, <laughs> he was talking so dramatically, then I finished it off with something so simple. Oh god, look at all these monitors. Batman is in hell. At least he could destroy these ones. Oh, there's too many of them, although we won't destroy all of those. Is there an Easter egg up here or something? I feel like there should be an Easter egg. Ah! There is one of these. Okay. No? Neither of those are... None of these are cryptographic sequencer things. I can't use any of those to open... Ah, okay, there we go. I was about to say, one of those has to, like, involve a Riddler trophy or something like that. So let's just open up that thing. That's a, a nice little cell we have open. Too bad there's not a villain in it. That'd be nice if, like... I don't know. Who, who's a villain who isn't in this game? Crazy Quilt! Crazy Quilt would be so good if we release Crazy Quilt, and then he just runs about and destroys all of Gotham City or something. We've got an interview tape, as always. Let's see what's planned with this one. Victor has been in isolation since the attack on the guard last week. As I wait for him to be brought up to me, I have had time to review his notes. I am increasingly worried he cannot be cured. He has no empathy for his victims. Deep down, I believe he views all of us as potential victims. Doc, are you okay? What's happening? It's Zaz. He broke out of isolation. He's gone. Oh, God! Don't worry, Doc. You're in the safest place. He's definitely left the island. Of course. But someone needs to alert the authorities. He'll need to kill again. Do you understand me? Needs to. Oh, no. He's gone after Dr. Cassidy. Poor, poor Dr. Sarah. Zaz, as always. He's such a jerkwad, always talking about his mark. When really, I don't know, he leaves a bad mark in society or something like that. I probably should plan that out better. But you know what, it's... It's, it's okay, it's okay. I, I tried my hardest, and really, if there's nothing else I could say, I'm a man who, who, who tries my hardest when, uh, from time to time, try to give good jokes and stuff like that. I feel it. Oh, oh, this, it's this portion. I like how Harley Quinn actually decided to plan uh, for this. Like, like, what, what, did she put the Riddler trophy in there herself? Or did, uh, did, um, the Riddler do it and she just set this up somehow? I also like how she's taunting me when I'm, like, in a prison cell, but so is she. I mean, I guess she's just saying, like, oh, some... Some evil uh, goons will come and rescue her and then kill me, but what if security guards came? Then it would have been completely pointless. Now I got an old man. Old man suck, so let's just uh, let him talk and do his thing. Honestly, probably should just turn him off. I'm pretty sure if I click like A or, or X or something when he starts uh, blab babbling on, I'm pretty sure that would get him to shut his trap, but you know. Silly Harley Quinn, you're so silly. Alright, let's go hunt down the Joker. It's high time we actually got, uh, continued on with some actual plot relevant information in this video. Already about five minutes through, which is, um, which is, uh, one fifth of the way. Yay! Another present! I don't know why, I really like those things in this game. They, they, oh, Joker. Hello, buddy. What's up? A B plus? Yeah, so am I. Well, actually, you know, maybe a B-plus would be a suiting grade for Batman, since he is the Batman, you know. B, B-plus kind of works well together or something like that. But, um, I don't know, the second letter is an A, so maybe you could go from a B to an A, and then go for an A to a T, because, you know, everyone gets T grades. Where am I supposed to go? I totally forgot to actually check for the fragment things. But then again, we're also going... I do know that we're actually going to the, uh, the, um, 
the garden. So we could actually just go ahead and try to work our way there. Granted, actually, this is probably a reason why I should focus more on where we're going, because, yeah. Yeah, I'm totally going the wrong way. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was about to say I in no way actually remember how to leave this building. Um... You would think uh, the, 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 the Batman should know Arkham City so well at this point. Th this, I think, would really take away from the game, so I'm not seriously saying that this should be added. But you would think at this point that Batman would know the Asylum so well that they would just do one of those racing game or, like, Crazy Taxi-esque, um, big arrows that would pop on top of the screen to be like, Oh, you're supposed to go this way, you foolish fool! Um... Because Batman's like, yeah, the gardens, I know where the gardens is. The gardens, you take a left at Albuter Albuquerque and, uh, I don't know, you'll arrive there at dawn or, or half past morning or something like that. Wait, wh whoa! Oh my god, I am so bad. Okay, you know what? Is that stuff gonna be here? No. I thought that we were gonna follow Har Harley Quinn's blueprints, just to be extra careful. We're, well, whatever. Apparently, I'm a complete idiot, and I have no idea where to go. Um, I apologize <laughs> that this has been taking me so long. This is the door that we need to go through, and there's a crazy man, so let's just... Uh, oh, oh! Oh, God! That actually really, really scared me. I, th I thought Batarang stop him! I guess not. They also do a lot of damage to Batman, so I guess we're just gonna have to uh, try to avoid getting hit, for, uh, hit by those guys whenever possible. Is there a way to get up there? We need the sequencer, correct? Um... I don't know if, the, if that's what we need. If it is, we don't have the long enough range for it. We could actually go ahead and test that out, though. Let's go for the range amplifier. Man, not, not necessarily the best thing to get, but I would actually like to see if the, we can go ahead and... Oh! If we can go ahead and actually grab whatever trophy will be up here. And it looks like we did it! Oh, that's the radio going on right now. I thought it was someone talking to us. Yes! Batman is too good! Too cool for school. Let's see what we have ahead up here. I wouldn't be surprised if there actually is uh, a bigger reward for us up here. There's more photos of people who are uh, clinically insane, but of course that doesn't really matter to us. There's a dead guard, some papers we can knock in the air for funsies, a book which is probably a Riddler trophy? No! Really? I don't know. That looks like that would be like Archimedes' book or something. Um, or Arkham... Is this Neymar? Wait, what? This is just a shortcut? What the hell? There's gotta be something up here, right? Apparently not. Well, well okay. I, apparently I'm a complete idiot and I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing in this game. So let's just actually forget everything else, go with actual plot relevant things and get out of here. We'll be like uh, that one character from James and the Giant Peach and be like, Let's get out of here! Hello, buddy. How's it going? Um, it's nice of you to say hello, especially in the shower. Um, I'm pretty sure that guy probably did plan to start attacking Batman in the shower because there's one place that you do want to be attacked by insane people, and I do mean do. It's in the shower because that's where they're going to show you the most love, you know? Who knows, maybe you're in a grumpy mood and you're like, no, I, I, I'm not, I don't want you to, like, smother my, the back of my neck, insane man, I, oh my lord, can you just please leave me alone? <laughs> just gonna fall on the floor like a total ding dong. Yeah, we actually damaged the floor, I love it whenever the tiles break in this game. Doesn't happen very often, but it's an effect that I actually think is really, really cool. We're also gaining a little bit of health as well, so we're not in the, uh, the red danger zone anymore. Can we please take this guy down? Okay, so we can knock them over. I presume I just messed it up last time? Uh, okay, so we're in Arkham West and we need to be in Arkham East. I believe we could also take the shortcut by going over here instead of, uh, going along the other ways. Oh god, okay, this is gonna be a big question. Is- is Batman faster than the insane men? Run, Batman! I think we are. Uh, they're at least not catching up on me so far. There's pro- OH GOD! Okay, probably shouldn't have stopped running if I was, uh, going to do any of that. Let's grapple out of here. Okay. Good start. Can we do throw a psionic batarang down there and beat up one of the guys that way? Well, it did absolutely nothing. Thank you for doing what you're meant to, psionic batarang. 
Um, <laughs> or Sonic Batarang, not Psionic. We knock that guy down. Are his friends chilling? Uh, they're over there. Let's take a little bit of a chance. Walk over here on the side because for whatever reason it makes me feel safer. Okay, the guys are leaving. The guys are leaving. Cool. We're not gonna die. Batman's actually gonna live uh, to see another day. As long as we don't die in the next area. Oh my god, they're coming for me! Run, Batman, run! Okay. Oh my god, can you just leave me be? Those other guys might be catching up! Okay! Okay, cool, the door closed, so they're not gonna be showing up. We can feel okay then. Would like to get a little bit more health though, that's obviously something to say the least, because... One more, uh, at this point, one more punch won't kill me, but we're getting very dangerously low on health. So uh, actually, every one of these inmates that we come across, that's going to be a really easy kill. That'll actually certainly be a very, very good thing for, for us right now. Because apparently I am bad at video games. I'm as bad at bi video games as Batman is at uh, talking to women. Up. Oh. No, what? He was down! He was down! Oh my god, the game betrayed me. Hey, someone held Bat Baby up off the- Yeah, I don't really care, Joker. You can tell me all you want. I swear that we were okay, but apparently I was completely wrong about this. They I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> this part with the- God, get off of me. Okay, so they do run faster than me. The, the This part with the crazy inmates is probably quite easily my least favorite part of the game. They're not really fun. They just kind of like jump on you and force you to tap A rapidly in, in annoyance, but um... But we're not gonna have to deal with this too long, later on we're gonna get crazy plant life instead, and uh, well those aren't as fun as the regular guards, they're better than the insane guys. That That's probably one of the, the best things, or one of, one of the many upgrades in Arkham City in my opinion. There's a lot less tedium, or uh, annoying parts of the game, and there aren't very many of them in this game, but they, they do exist out. from time to I time. Can't waste any time in finding the Titan production plant. Is this the, uh... I know this is a trophy, is is this the one with, uh, I'm Dumb and Dumber? You are cheating. You must be. I'm not cheating, Riddler. You're just being a little baby like you always are. There's a uh, one with Twildy and Twild Dumb in here. I don't think that was it though, but who knows? Maybe it was. Ah, another thing, Magic. Is this Poison Ivy? Patient yes, indeed. Okay, here is why I think that the uh, the staff at Arkham Asylum is full of the world's biggest idiots. Judging by what was said there, at the time of that recording, it's been a like who knows? Maybe that was an old recording, so the people at Arkham don't know how uh, Poison Ivy works. No. No, in that very same interview tape, they said it's been a year since, um, since Poison Ivy first became Poison Ivy. How do they, why would they ever give a, like, put a male, use a male to, um, or, or, or I should word it like this, why would they have a male psychiatrist, like, have sessions with her. Obviously, she's gonna use her powers on him. Like, it's not like she needs any piece of technology for them. She just does it naturally. But, oh, wow, that actually killed them just by throwing them into the electricity. That's pretty cool. Um, like, the, the, the people at this, at this institute, or what, well, I don't know what the institute is the proper word, but the, the, the people, the staff at this asylum are such freaking idiots. 
Like, I don't know what is up with them. I, I know that uh, women can be taken over by Poison I Ivy stuff because, uh... I, I, I don't know if it works the same way, but I know in Batman Hush, Poison Ivy actually manipulated uh, Catwoman or Selina Kyle. But she's known for controlling men. So why why would they ever put a man to, uh, to watch her? Okay, looks like we actually got a lot of baddies in this room. So this is going to be a fun one. We even had like a straight up, uh, like... A uh, stealth section in quite a while in this game, or at least as, as far as I remember. So it's gonna be a good time peeing up these guys. Of course, what's a better way to start it off as well than with an inverted takedown? Then we'll probably probably jump over here. If we if we don't glide kick this guy, yeah, yeah. Batman drop. No. Uh, oh no. Okay, wait. How about? No, those guys are chilling together. Is there any way to get down below without being seen? I don't know if that's necessarily the case. But we can do- what we can do is we can use a so sonic battering on that guy. That'll be a good way to finish him off. So that's him down as well. Only two more. They are chilling in groups of two. So let's try to, uh, start preparing a distraction or something. I think that would be a good idea. We could spray some of our glorious bat gel all over the floor. And, uh, if we ever do get them to go over there, then that should be an easy takedown. If we knock that guy down, will that do a distraction? Eh, uh, not really, but that dude's, uh, all, all by his lonesome, so let's try to finish him off. Oh! Oh, he's such a foolish fool! He went all by himself! Yes! Smother him to death, Batman. Smother him to death. There we go. Probably should have saved actually the the bat stuff for that dude because now that guy's collar is gonna go crazy and they're gonna know to go up there. In the treetops, I kind of like that. Uh, we could actually go ahead and let's let. No, it's too late. It's too late. I was gonna say we could try playing it a different way and attack those dudes once they get up the stairs because uh, they would go up one by one, or at least one would imagine they would. But, uh, they're gonna, they're gonna be idiots and separate anyways, so if, if we glide kick that guy, we'll be able to take him down before anyone's able to spot us, I, I think. Oh, oh, there isn't a thing? I thought there was a thing! Oh god, okay, okay, Batman, hide behind a corner. <laughs> Does he see me? Uh, I mean, clearly he doesn't see me right now, I just don't know if I'm in danger. I mean, it's, if, if, if nothing else, this is not a good place to be in the long run. Oh my god, I think it actually worked. Okay, we're good. No! No! Thank my fans for their They turned. He made a Dota 2 reference right there. Um, yeah, there was this floor. What happened to this floor? Did I just not see it and I couldn't crouch hide in it anymore? I don't know. All things considered, that was honestly probably my fault. Let's go ahead and try ledge to take down this guy. Yes! Okay. That's one dude down, uh, while still allowing us to do inverted takedowns and stuff like that. What? Oh, I didn't think we'd be seen. That's my bad. Because, uh, going back to what I was saying, I may be wrong about this, but I think you can actually only do one inverted takedown per, like, combat, uh, sequence. Nobody's gonna see me grab this guy, so that's a good way to start. We'll start with this dude. May even be able to ledge take down that guy afterwards. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh, even better! All the glory is ours. Yes! Suck it, buddy. Okay, now we should put down our mat, uh, our man, bat juice or uh, bat spray. Go ahead and put that down there. Look for an inverted takedown between uh, the dudes who are here. I don't think we're gonna get one, but there is also always the psionic battering. Let's use that on this guy. Suck it, buddy! That actually, now that I think about it, should mean that they won't go over to that spot where the explosive gel is. That's unfortunate, but not all that necessary to uh, finish him off that way. So let's see. Um, what would be a good next step? We can actually just detonate that stuff if we want. Because obviously that would get them to go to that position. Or at least it should. So, those... Okay, so those guys are teaming up because they're freaking jerkwads. 
They don't like the bats at all. But I love them, and that's all that matters. So you know what? Let's go ahead and detonate that. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay, cool! They shouldn't turn around, or at least I don't think they will. Come on, come on, come on! Yes! God, I love this game. It is so freaking satisfying when you're able to do these things. Bat chill! Uh, okay, okay, I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button because I'm not used to the controls in this game. I'm used to the controls in Arkham City, and apparently that's something that I'm never gonna get over. So... What's the best way to handle this? Can we actually... Okay, so... That's one dude coming up here, or coming down here, technically. I don't know if he's gonna keep on walking our way, but if we get lucky... If we get super lucky, he'll end up Christopher walking our way, and he'll be like, Oh, hello, little bat. I hauled this, uh, watch up my ass, and you killed all my friends, so I don't like you anymore. Okay, great, we're actually getting two of them. Hmm. Doing a takedown from this position probably wouldn't be all that good uh, if they're together, because I think the other guy shooting me might be enough to kill me um, before I can actually turn on him, but I'm not sure. Uh, can you guys please move? Thank you. <laughs> I, was, I was thinking. Oh, don't see me! Oh, yes! Yeah, I quite- I, I- Joker, you're not wrong, buddy. I quite literally can pop out of nowhere. In fact, that's what I just did. Because this man is a foolish fool. And we could probably- Oh, let's actually jump off now? Cool beans! Cool beans! Oh! Oh! The ultimate ledge takedown, please! Let me do it! Oh, no. No! 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 No, 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 no! <laughs> it wouldn't let me do a ledge takedown! And then he saw me! Oh my god. I think that was bull, personally. Because how could I not do a ledge takedown there? That is, that is a big load of baloney, and the game knows it. And uh, the game should feel very, very sorry for itself. Because the, if the guy was close enough to be able to shoot me, and I could do a ledge takedown on this guy right here, or at least was able to do it where with where he was before, then I should have totally been able to do a ledge takedown on that guy, but you know, whatever. Hopefully that guy won't move yet. Oh, oh, okay. No, he jumped. I wanted to do an inverted takedown, but apparently that wasn't quite gonna be a thing. Because I kinda wanna save the psionic battering, but I don't know if that's gonna be a possibility. Oh, we might be able to take down the guy below us, but he's kind of standing at an irritating position Because it's really a location that we can't really get behind him in So he would just spot us from the front, but that dude over there that guy's gonna be easy Okay, so let's go ahead try to take down one of these guys. Sometimes I have no idea how the dudes don't see Batman <laughs> like when I use the grapple hook there and when I'm standing right here How does that guy across the way not see me? These guys just pay no attention to the- How did that guy not see me? God, I love this game. Oh, shoot. Okay. Um, I think a good thing to do now- Uh, okay, he found that dude. Not good to- Okay, we're good. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna take down one of those dudes because that should leave this man available for an inverted takedown. Then it's only one man. He's all alone. He could suck it. We're gonna dominate the world. So yeah. This fight here took me a lot longer than it should, and I guess technically it's not over yet, but I'm pretty sure we just did it. Simple glide takedown won't be enough to finish him off. Or can we just drop on him? That's always the fun way to do things. Yeah! Landed right on his face! And then we punched it into the ground. He beat you all again. What does it take? An army of monsters? Uh-oh. Ah, oh, Joker, I get your joke, buddy. It's, an ar it's funny because an army of monsters is something he's trying to make. Ho ho ho! So absolutely hilarious. Uh, there's actually something secret in here, but I think, um, ah, you know what? We could see what's in here, then we'll go ahead and end off the episode. Unless this is actually a place that we could have gone for combat. Oh, no, just a Riddler trophy, along with, uh, what the hell? Like, Gnome Jesus or something like that. Oh! Okay, that stain going down? I thought that that was part of the statue. So I thought this was like a gnome 
on a cross with wings or something like that. Still really, really weird looking, but not as weird as I thought it was. Anyways, I think that's actually gonna be it for this video. We can leave it off on, uh, freaking Gnome Jesus right here. He's, uh, the most glorious and holy of all the gnomes. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like, comment, and or subscribing if you have not. I am the Egg Scrambled Gamer, and I will see you all next time.